terrific race. Oh, thank you. I really um, put everything ahead. <laughs> Beth Hyden Reed is one of the most gifted and dynamic multi sport athletes to ever compete in the United States. She has excelled in speed skating, cross country skiing, and bicycle racing. Born in Madison, Wisconsin, Beth originally took up cycling as part of her cross training for speed skating. We did a lot of summer activities and one of them was biking and my brother started going to bike races because of this uh, training we were doing and then my dad started training um, with us when we did our biking and he started going to the bike races and they were having a lot of fun and so that's sort of what drew me in. Beth rode in the 1979 National Cycling Championships while riding in the junior division. I qualified for nationals at that race and showed up at nationals still not owning any of the right stuff, but my dad lent me a pair of bike shorts and Connie Carpenter lent me one of our, our jerseys from our team. And um, I went to the starting line all decked out and lo and behold, the chief referee of our race standing there at the line looks at me and says, Oh, I see you got some bike clothes and some bike shoes. And all the other girls on the starting line turn and stare at me. And one girl says, what did you used to wear, honey? I was like, oh, no. <laughs> Compared to today's sponsored racers, Beth had to rely on luck and connections to obtain a proper racing bicycle. I um, went to the Red Zinger uh, Bicycle Classic in Colorado, which at the time was the biggest stage race for women in the world and I didn't really have much of a bike. I had bought a used bike for 200 bucks that I was racing on and it was too big for me. The front fork was bent. A bicyclist named John Howard who was on the Olympic team in the early 70s, he was one of the, the very first um, really good international cyclists we had since uh, way back in Major Taylor days. He saw me he was working with Exxon, and they were making the very first graphite bikes. And he said, say, I, I can give you a frame. Would you like that? And I was like, oh my gosh. And then when I rode in the World Championships in 1980 in France, on our team was Miji Riak, who was really the mother of competitive cycling and in this country. And she took me aside and coached me. And she gave me every tip she could think of, which was years worth of um, riding advice because she felt that I had a chance to win. And when I won that race, I think Miji was even happier than I was. Then it was totally biking. That's when I got my serious uh, streak in biking and had a very serious summer with a lot of good results. Beth indeed had some good results in 1980. In fact, they were record-breaking after winning a bronze medal in the 3,000 meter speed skating event in the 1980 Winter Olympics in Lake Placid, Beth won the U.S. Road Racing Championship in 1980 in Arizona. She went on to win the 1980 World Road Championship title in France. Haydn was also the overall women's division winner of the Coors Classic stage race in 1980. By the end of 1980, she was named Sportswoman of the Year by the U.S. Olympic Committee. She now lives in Northern California with her husband and three children. She has an undergraduate degree in math and a master's degree in science in civil engineering. Now known as Beth Hyden Reed, she rides a bicycle daily to her work at Apple Computers. Biking is a big part of my life. Um, my competitive career was pretty small, but um, my whole life revolves around bikes, whether it's commuting, um, going on vacation. My ideal of a vacation is a bike tour. Um, I put my kids out of their bikes. Um, everything's done on a bike in this family.